Mick Jagger said a final goodbye to Loren Scott before his girlfriend was laid to rest in a Hollywood cemetery yesterday. Jagger's daughters and grandchildren also spoke at the private funeral for Scott at the historic Hollywood Forever Cemetery. Scott, a notable fashion designer and Jagger's longtime girlfriend, was found dead in her apartment in New York last week. The medical examiner concluded that the 48-year-old killed herself by hanging. There are speculative reports that she was in debt over $6 million with her fashion designing business and that it could have contributed to her depression. It is almost 20 years ago that 27-year-old singer Kurt Cobain died of a self-inflicted gunshot wound. As the anniversary of the death of the lead singer of the band Nirvana approaches early next month, rumors have stirred on social media that police might be reopening the case. They are not, they have said in a statement, but they are releasing new photos of the crime scene. The released photos do not include images of Kurt Cobain's dead body, but the dingy scratched images of syringes, a tainted spoon, lighter, and other personal belongings strewn across the floor will likely bring fans back to sad memories. Gore lead singer Dave Brocky died Sunday. Brocky was 50 years old. His body was found by his bandmate at his home in Richmond, Virginia. An autopsy will be done to determine why he died. Guar, the metal band formed in 1984, billing itself as Earth's only openly extraterrestrial rock, ba rock band, Brocky performed as Guar's frontman under the persona Odorous Arungus. The band was based on mythology of an elite group of chaos warriors who ravaged the galaxy until they were banished to the most insignificant planet in the universe, the seething mudball known as Earth. That's your entertainment this week. I'm Carrie Shirell.